I went and picked up one of our um, grandsons the other day and decided that we we're going to bring him to the Darling Down Zoo. Um, John was meant to come, but he has been sick for about two weeks, so he can't come. Anyhow, it was like a 15 minute drive and this has happened. Sound asleep. I don't think he's going to wake up anytime soon, so we'll just sit in the car and wait, I suppose. What are we going to go and find now? We're going to go and find the lion. And the tigers? And the tiger. Cool, let's go find them. We've been a bit disappointed so far in this zoo, haven't we? Yeah. We bought food and we haven't been able to um, feed any animals yet. Yeah. So if we do feed the animals, we can. Yeah, and we'll film you feeding them, okay? Okay. All right, let's go find the lions and the tigers. Yeah, I let's think there's, do it. I think there's some monkeys just there, though. We might have to stop at them first. Okay, let's go. Let's go. <coughs> what do you reckon <coughs> that is, Kai? <coughs> monkeys. Monkeys? <coughs> See if we can find those tigers. Yeah. Okay. We're at the tigers, and Kai's just found the tiger, and Grandma was like, "Where? I can't see it anywhere." He's hidden. Wow. Way over there. That's the tiger. Listen to those gibbons. They're terrible. But there's the tiger. So Kai's decided at the zoo, it's more important to collect rocks. You got enough rocks there? Yeah. All right. I, I just can't carry them because I don't have bigger hands. You don't have bigger hands. Then you wouldn't put them in Grandma's backpack. Yeah, I want to. What are these animals over here behind the fence? What? Giraffes. Call him. I, I don't know what to say to call him. Oh, he's saying yes. Is he? Yeah. He's right there. He's spreading his legs, Kai. Maybe he'll fall. Yeah. Maybe if he does that, he might fall. So that's why he's spreading his legs. Maybe so. But I saw a giraffe was rolling like over. It was rolling. Yeah, like. Look at his tongue. <laughs> yeah. Whoa. There's some other tigers. Maybe we'll find some other tigers. We can come at 10 to 11 to see them get fed. We can only see one. All right, after the tiger, there's supposed to be leopards up here, Kai. So far, I wouldn't write home about it. I suppose it's a, a good little place to bring your kids. But yeah. Do you like this zoo so far? Yeah. You do? What have you liked best so far? Uh, everything. Okay. Oh, there we go. That's a cheetah. See if I can get up closer to him. What's that smell? Oh, there's a smell there, isn't there? All the animals seem to be one off, so they're lonely.
we've got African white lions down here. But every animal we've seen has been asleep. Yeah. You want to watch it? Look at them, Kai? Yeah, I can see them. They don't even respond to the keepers coming for food, with their food, like... Now hold it like that. Just like that. Right. Can I hold it myself? The tiger won't come for a dinner. Is she coming? What is it? There's a mama one and a daddy one. A mama and daddy what? Tiger. Lion. Yeah, lion. Whoa. Come on, let's keep going. All right, we'll keep going. That down there is a llama. Yeah, it's got a big butt. It's got a big butt, has it? Yeah. A Peruvian llama. Can it go super fast? Can it go super fast? I'm not sure, but I wouldn't stand right behind its butt. What she doesn't spit, I think those things spit. So we'll just wait there. Come down here a bit. There's a few of them in there. Hello, Mr. Llama. That one's a girl. It's a girl, is it? Sorry. Monkeys. What sort of monkeys are they? Baboons. And they talk fairly loud. I don't think they're, they're as loud as those um, gibbons. Maybe the prickles in the cactus don't worry them. Yeah. There's a big lizard. Can you see the big lizard in there? Where? Behind that tree. You see him? He's got his eyes closed at the moment. Oh, there's another one down there, Kai. Another big lizard down there. Where? Down near that tree down there. There. Yeah, Look at that! Put your hand near it, Kai. There's glass there, you can do it. That's cool. Was that cool? Yep, but I'll stay at the tail end. Okay. So we're all finished at the zoo, Kai. Did you like it? Yeah. What did you like the best? Ice cream. Oh, the ice cream at the end. What animal was the noisiest? All of them. They weren't noisy. That big monkey was noisy, wasn't it? Mm -hmm. Yeah, yeah. I don't know. There was a lot of cages that were empty. Most of the animals were asleep. They weren't moving around. So that was a bit sad, wasn't it? And when we went for the tiger feeding, the tiger wasn't interested in getting food. So it just laid right at the back of the enclosure. Yeah, but we still got to see them. We still got to see them, yeah. And we got to see the big giraffes. Yeah, and we got to still see them feed. What were those big things right at the end that you just pretended to touch, but there was glass in between? What was that massive big thing? He put his head up at the glass. A snake. The snakes. Big boa constrictors and anacondas. Oh, huge, hey. So did you like that zoo or do you think there's other better zoos? I like the zoo. Okay, he liked the zoo. I think there's better zoos, but that's Darling Down Zoo in a nutshell. Took us, what, two hours and that was pushing it. So, yeah. Okay, I just want to give you um, just a bit more information about this zoo. The reason why I just didn't think it was that crash hot a lot of the enclosures were overgrown um, and I found that Kai couldn't stand up on anything to look in. I had to keep lifting him up to look in where a lot of the other zoos have little platforms that the kids can climb up and, and see the animals easily. Um, they, are, they have got a lot of expansion going on and that's fine but yeah the animals 
they were few and far between and they're all asleep and I know they can't help that but basically we bought a, a bag of animal food couldn't even feed any of the animals so um, yeah so look it's a little family zoo it's well run the animals look well cared for um, there's plenty of people here there's lots more cars that have turned up but um, yeah oh and there's cactuses everywhere Kai nearly prickled put prickles in his fingers so many times because outside the enclosure they just had all these cactus bushes and it's like mate you can't touch them you're gonna get prickles I don't understand why they would have cactus bushes planted outside animal enclosures where kids are going to come up and look at the animals so that's a yeah that's a bit silly but anyhow that's why I don't like it Kai seemed to have a good time you had a good time yeah okay Thank you.